Welcome to TRICARE Overseas. In this video, you will learn how to manage web users in the Administration section. To access administration, you will need to be logged in. To log in, just type your username and password in the login box shown on screen, and then select the Login button. This will allow you to have access to all of the secured sections, including administration. The default in the administration section is the My Locations tab. Depending on your level of access, Standard versus Administrator, you may have other tabs to Manage Web Users, Accept or Reject Pending Access Requests, and My Pending Invites. This section will focus on the Manage Web Users, Pending Access Requests, and My Pending Invites. On the Manage Web Users tab, you will be able to filter by location or display all locations that you are the administrator for. You can also sort by user role all users, administrator, or standard. You will see a list of all users based on the filter and sort criteria. For each user you will see their name, user ID, the number of locations they have access to, and if they have any pending requests for locations you administrate. Select the View Details button to remove access, change the access type, standard or administrator, or accept or reject access to other locations. This section will be an advantage when a web user leaves the position they are in or no longer needs access to the locations you administrate. From the Manage Web Users tab, the administrator can invite a new web user by selecting the Invite New Web User button. Just fill in the fields given, select the access type from the drop-down, and enter a security code. The security code is a value made up by the administrator that will need to be communicated to the user that they are inviting. Without this security code, they will not be able to complete the registration process. Then you will choose the locations the user will have access to upon completion of their registration. Select the Submit User Info button. This will send an email to the user for them to finish the registration process. From the Pending Access Request tab, the administrator will see a list of all web users that have requested access to a location that they administer. The administrator can accept or reject all users at the same time, or do each one individually. From the My Pending Invites tab, the administrator will see a list of all users that they have invited as a new user and that have not completed the registration process yet. You will have a notification of how long the security code is valid. If this is allowed to expire, the administrator will need to restart the process of sending a new invite. We have reached the end of this Manage Web Users tutorial. We hope the information we provided was helpful. Have a great day.